All righty, Todd's back. We're at the middle part of the week. Yeah. And depending where you were yesterday, I mean. Where were you? I was, so I know where you tried to send me. I didn't, I didn't go there. I stayed in the part of the state where for me it was actually nice. I, I had the, yeah. the windows open for a little bit yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. I saw the, uh, what's it called? Um, the sun? It starts with the, the nest. Sun. Starts yeah, the yeah, nest. I saw the sun. So. Starts the nest, yeah. It's like, whoa, oh. I know, it took you oh. back a little like bit. Like gremlins. Right? It's like, whoa. I was like, wait a second. <laughs> I'm supposed to see the light. Right. So. They're going to multiply. Exactly. Yeah, You've already I, done that. Done plenty yeah, of that. Yeah. We don't need any more multiplication. Okay, let's not go there. <laughs> on your end. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, some parts of the state did get a little sun yesterday. We're a lot warmer than others. Check out where it didn't get sun. It rained quite a bit in Perry and Eastport and Lubeck. Down East Maine got drenched yesterday. Last 24 hours have picked up over two inches in places. Acadia National Park, an inch and a quarter. Ellsworth, an inch and a quarter. Bangor, less, but still wet for much of the last day or so with about two tenths of an inch of rain. And we continue to see rain falling throughout the state. It's not very heavy. Most of this is just sprinkles, but it is drab and dreary. That's going to be the case this morning in southern Maine. These are all very, very light showers and they're shriveling up as we're getting closer to sunrise. Roads are damp, though. Sidewalks are the grass is too. Get into eastern Maine. We have also some sprinkles in and around Bangor, heading up to Old Town through Orono. You get to Greenbush, you have some wet weather. And it's a little steadier to the north up in Aroostook County, closest to the area of low pressure. But spokes of energy will be rotating through today, tomorrow, Friday, and even Saturday. We're going to be under the influence of this area of low pressure. We're not very far away from some amazing weather. There's the high. It's clear through southern parts of Canada, through the Great Lakes and down through the Mid-Atlantic, too. If we could only reach out and grab that weather and drag it in. We can't, though. We got to wait till this thing gets out of here. Wet this morning from last night's rain and from some of those lingering sprinkles and showers. And it is on the cool side this morning. Temps are around 50. It'll be gray. It'll be gloomy for the middle of the day. We'll have scattered statewide showers, too. They really could pop up anywhere, unlike yesterday, where the heaviest rain was here, the lightest rain was down here. There could be sprinkles or light showers just about anywhere as we head through the afternoon. And it will be on the breezy side again and coolish as well. Our highs will be a notch chillier than yesterday. Yesterday, some places did hit 70, which is close to the average. Today, we won't. We'll be closer to 60 degrees in southern Maine for Lewiston. Portland hit 62, Sanford 63, and hovering in the 50s from Augusta to Waterville to Bangor to Bar Harbor and Callis, too, with highs only around 55. The pattern holds, as I mentioned, through Saturday. We'll have this unsettled stuff. Again, not washouts, but you'll have to keep that umbrella close by. Finally, by Sunday, high pressure works in. We get brighter sunshine, warmer temps, too, and it looks like this will hold through Monday. And then we'll have to keep an eye on the middle of next week. Tuesday would be our next threat for some rain. There's a chance it could be on the heavier side, too, with a tropical connection bringing up some downpours. Some good news, though, about next week. We're not going to have the really cold temperatures that we've had at times this week. We should be near average or even slightly above. And for mid-June next week, that means 70 to 75 degrees on average. And we'll take that. That would be good. Marine forecast sees two to three feet. Northwest winds five to 15 knots. Scattered showers today, cloudy skies, high around 60. Very similar tomorrow, also around 60 degrees. Pop up showers Friday afternoon, 62. Still the chance for a shower or two on Saturday, but most of the time it isn't raining and it won't be raining on Sunday or Monday. Both days look very good. Lots of sunshine out there and more summer like too, with highs between 70 and 75. Great, that works. That is good. That right. does work. Thanks, sir. Appreciate right. that.